Hello, this art statement is from my website. I thought to read it aloud and illustrate it with past and present work. The link is below. I aim for an emotional reflection rather than clarity or realism in my artwork. The technique is physically demanding, pushing, pulling, hammering, dampening and scraping surfaces. As well, pottery allows for an imperfect finish or surface to pieces stressing the acceptance of variation. This flows between my ceramics and painting. I believe art making is something innate within all of us, just needing an expression, and judging art from other times is a useless pursuit as it exists in its own place and time. However, as postmodernism stated, nothing is new, nothing is truly original, and recreation is the norm, so rather than being bothered by this, everything is available to play with. Art's most important role is self-discovery and self-expression, fulfillment which needs no standard technique or demand. My representations are based on memory, deconstruction, idiosyncratic thoughts, vivid sensitivity, literature, moods, archetypes, and natural world, otherness, and exploration. When very young, my father told me my art was useless. That made me feel so bad. He destroyed my artwork. My mother, who was artistic but chronically mentally ill, used my creativity to control me. That undermined my self-esteem. The person I remember who believed in me was my high school art teacher in 1969 who told me I did what I was going to do what I told others. This uplifted me to feel part of the world and still supports me when others disappoint or are less than effective. Painting and sculpting puts me in that supportive frame of mind. Thank you. I also identify as Aspie and therefore see the world in a non-typical way, but not a less way.